hello guys so i literally forgot to film the intro to this video uh so today i am taking you along as i get ready for sunday uh church i am going to show you my outfit and my hair for the day and i really really just hope you enjoy this video remember to subscribe like and comment and i love you very very much first thing that i do is of course make my bed while i am making my bed i am just gonna i just grab my phone and then i listen to some gospel music which i was already doing so yeah today i'm playing a lot of travis green because yeah he gets me into that groove you know uh so i'm just gonna go ahead and make my bed pick my clothes iron them and then i'm gonna go get ready to go shower so i'm coming to you all crusty this is me waking up <laughs> so yeah i'm just gonna go make my bed and then pick out the clothes for the day So, what I am wearing today is this skirt here. Uh, I got this, it's a pleated skirt. I got it from Mr. Price yesterday. And I am going to be matching it with this top here, which I also got from Mr. Price. I don't really know if the communi combinations will communicate, but I decided to go for this because black just looked dull and yeah so this is what I'm wearing today I'll show you when I get dressed I am still undecided between the shoes cause uh, with the shoes I was thinking to either go for the gold which is from Mr. Price I feel like today I'm plugging Mr. Price a lot or I can go with like a brown nude. This was from Solo. No, this was from Soul Candy, which was there in Campus Cresta and now it's gone. So I'm gonna go right ahead and get ready to shower. Um, yeah, I'll see you in a second. A bit of my face routine. So before I pop into the shower, I just put on the Garnier Skin Active Charcoal Mask. Uh, I just wash my face in the shower because it takes less time than to do a whole face routine. And it helps to do it that way. Of course, I'll turn my water to cool so that I don't burn my face. So I'm gonna leave this on for like two to three minutes and as it starts to dry then I'm gonna immediately go and shower then I'll be back to see you guys I'll show you the rest of my skin routine and how I put down my wig and yeah we'll just do makeup and then the clothing will come at the end yeah I've just come out of the shower now I'm just gonna show you my face routine so I just grabbed some cotton pads right there ooh, ooh, ooh. and then I'm just using micellar water to remove any dirt that might have been left on my skin while I exfoliated in the shower 
not a lot because I feel like the exfoliating did its thing. To neutralize the pH of my face, I'm just going to use the Daily Pore Reducing Toner from Garnier, also the Pure Active brand. Pure Active range, I mean. And I'm just putting it on my hand as opposed to putting it on a cotton pad. I saw this from the Good Skin channel. You should check it out. It's by a lady called Cuvet. I hope I pronounced their name right. Step would be to put my sunscreen. I use the every sun sunscreen and it's in SPF 50. It has a very good SPF. And then I just dab it around my face. Using SP, uh, a sunscreen has really been good to me because my dark spots have reduced significantly since. So if you're using something to remove your dark spots and it's not working, just try adding sunscreen to your routine because the sun can actually make dark spots appear more. Okay? So now, moving on to my moisturizer, still using the Pure Active range, but in this is the matte control, and it contr it controls shine and also removes blemishes. So my blemishes are being removed, and my sunscreen is preventing them from getting any darker. So I'm, I have a bit of breakout, I have a pimple here and a pimple there, that's just period pimples, nothing much to it. The hair that I'll be wearing today is my, I think it was 24 inches, something like that, and it's a lace frontal and it's just like a cap here. and. I curled it like two days before I curled it on Saturday I was bored no on Friday evening yes I was bored and then I just decided to curl it with some mousse if you want to know how I curl my wig I'll link the video up here so I'm just gonna set that aside and then I'm gonna take a, an old toothbrush and brush this my baby hair to the back so that it doesn't get caught with glue Here to glue down my wig, I use the L'Oreal Studio 10 and it's a gel glue, it's an indestructible gel glue. It's very good. I wish I could afford fucking got to be glue, but it's expensive. This is way cheaper. Okay, I'll take the glue and just put it on my edges, and I'm gonna be doing that by using the back of the toothbrush. Just dipping it in the gel glue there. It's like a very tacky consistency. So I'll just face down to my mirror so I don't make a mistake. It's a little bit tacky. I'm just reaching out for my hair dryer and then I'm gonna use it on the cool setting up here on the lowest speed.
am done now i've also like just fluffed out my hair and this is the final look my dark circles are not visible at all today and that's the eyeshadow look that i have on today I am off to church now. Yo, I look yellow. It's the lighting. Well, I am off to church. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on other videos, on other later videos. Not to self. I will never film on a Sunday again because I just became very late for church, which is not good. I really like my outfit today. I feel like a grown up woman. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> anyway please remember to like comment and subscribe i love you all